Okay, so I want to show you a little illustration involving the triangle sum theorem. The triangle sum theorem, which is sometimes called the triangle angle sum theorem because it's really about the angles in a triangle, or the um, triangle interior angle sum theorem because it's about the interior angles in a triangle, it's the one that says all the angles in a triangle have to add up to 180. And while I know you would probably believe that, I'm going to show it to you in a way that kind of proves it. So let me just start out by talking about a line. I drew a line here, and I just want to go first with the agreement that if I have a line, that on one side of the line, like if I think of this as like an angle, where maybe this would be the vertex, one side of, an, of a line is 180 degrees. Because remember, all the way around is 360. And 180 plus 180 adds up to 360. So all of the, de the degrees on one side of a line should add up to 180. Another way of thinking about that is a line, which is sometimes called a straight angle. We could think of it as an angle that measures 180. OK, so assuming you believe that, that a line measures 180, I have made a triangle. I drew a triangle. Doesn't matter what kind of triangle I drew. I drew one. Mine kind of ended up looking like a right triangle, but it doesn't have to. It could look like any kind of triangle. And I'm going to prove to you that these measurements add up to 180 without ever measuring any of them. Here's how I'm going to do it. First, I'm going to cut out my triangle. And you could do this with any size triangle. OK, so here's my triangle. It has three angles. And again, I'm trying to prove to you that those three angles add up to 180. All right, so I'm going to take the angles. And actually, let me number them. I'm going to angle, number them angle 1, angle 2, angle 3. And I'm going to tear up my triangle. I'm not mad at it. I'm just tearing these angles apart. So there's angle 1. And now let me tear apart angles 2 and 3. So I have the three angles of my triangle torn apart. So now I'm going to go back to that line. Remember that we said a straight line has to measure 180 degrees. So this time I drew my straight line on graph paper. Here's my straight line. And when I say straight line, really, that's kind of a, a weird thing to say. It doesn't have any meaning because all lines are straight. If it wasn't a straight line, we would call it a curve. But so, you know, a straight line or a line. And if all this on one side has to add up to 180, then when I put my angles, my three angles I tore out of my triangle, up next to the line, with their tips touching, like that's the vertex of the angle, look what's going to happen. They're going to take up all the space on one side of the line, which means they have to all add up to 180. So we have just proven the triangle angle sum theorem, or sometimes it's just called the triangle sum theorem. That the three angles of a triangle add up to 180.